What's going on everybody and thank you for tuning in. Just wanted to quickly talk about the tow haul mode button with you if you haven't used it yet. So one thing I want you to look out for when you use the button, all right, is where you're using the button. And what I mean by that is when you turn tow haul mode button on, it makes the truck feel really jumpy and, and ready to go. So <laughs> don't use tow haul mode if you're in the middle of a turn or if you're in the middle of a turn, like if you're sitting at a stop sign and you're gonna turn and go and you have tow haul mode on, take your time. Don't mash the pedal, you're gonna spin the truck out, you're gonna end up going through a fence and into a yard or something. So please take your time, go easy on the pedal, go straight first, go straight down the road first with it to understand it so you don't hurt yourself or hurt the truck or anything else or property, okay? Um, I know that sounds kind of stupid, but the other day I um, had tow haul mode on and I was going to make a turn and as I made the turn I realized how aggressive the turn was. I didn't mash the pedal or anything like that, but it just made me think that someone's going to get behind the wheel and put tow haul mode on and not know that there's that much jump in the truck right off the bat. So make sure you go easy with it when you first get it until you understand it. You turn it on be wide open where you're not going to hit anything and just learn it before you uh, start making aggressive turns with it things like that also this is kind of a duh but don't use it in the rain all right it's just it has the potential to cause too much wheel spin i don't want you to go spinning out and anything like that i don't want you to hurt yourself with anything you learn on this channel so that's why i'm giving you some of these uh do nots so uh if it's raining out just leave it in regular mode and take your time and go easy and number three, um, it's, it's really unnecessary on the highway. Like getting up to speed with it is cool, but once you're at highway speed, just leave it in normal mode. Let the gearing be, you know, the most fuel efficient it can be. Uh, a lot of people use it on the highway and they live and die by it. But personally, I went out there and I didn't really see a benefit of it. Um, I just left it in normal mode and everything was cool. It's great for local, you know, day-to-day uh, -day travel. You know, if you're in like a little city and stuff like that. It's great stop and go. The thing really wants to, to get up and go, which is really cool. But on the highway, you know, you're just cruising. You want to be as fuel efficient as possible. So watch out with your turns. Be careful. Don't go spinning out into anything. Don't use it in the rain. And that includes snow, sleet, all kinds of weather. Just be careful when you use it. And uh, really unnecessary on the highway. But comment below the video and tell me what you think. I want to know how everybody's doing with tow haul mode. Um, do you have any questions? I've become a tow haul mode expert because I use it all the time. But I use it when it's sunny, it's nice out, there's no rain, and I'm careful on my turns. So comment below the video or find me on Twitter and Instagram at Tundra234. You guys have a great day.